okay we have changed our assets and our G our CSS's to from green to red we've checked every file and everything looks good so now we have we have to make the assets themselves what we're gonna do now is this here Control A delete so the GTK 30318 the assets gone yeah GTK 20 um, assets green delete gone they will be made with the script and assets start the same delete gone that's it thinking 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 that's it next up this is the most powerful script I've ever seen so it's going to make all kinds of variations since um, we're going to make a new theme I was wondering is there anything more creative than making it mint y red is there a name for this red sometimes it's uh, funny to see that these colors got a name and then I use it to name my theme but no no let's have a quick look let me indulge me but I'll just pause it how about that the red I've chosen is called fire brick so why not call it fire how about that so I'm going to change this here to fire let's quickly copy paste this control C control V control V it's going to be written in themes it's going to update everything assets render everything cinnamon bar cinnamon fine great just do your thing but this should be fire this should be fire we're talking about fire fire and fire fire that's it save it and let the wonders of the script go on we will see some errors but that's good and you know that everything is normal but I'm going to delete just for sure just to show you guys delete everything inside of this here everything is gone delete and then we can see what will happen if we run the theme um, let's go back here to the source build themes here we have to type python build build themes in another movie I have um, I have instructed that you need a lot of stuff to install let me just quickly just say it now you know you need to sudo apt install uh, ruby ruby says r-u-b-y dash s-a-s-s and opti png o-p-t-i-p-n-g and for the rest i use some tools uh, sublime text uh, brackets and catfish those were the tools of course inkscape you should have installed it y and um, i n k s c a p a e e yeah. all right so everything is as installed in my computer here i'm going to build it what's happening now let's put it here voilà. let's put this there is making things and let's delete this one maybe put it a bit bigger he's making a lot of stuff he's updating gtk3 he is writing these kind of files write gtk darker css this one and this one he has changed that great thanks for doing that and then he's going to the assets rendering the assets and he's making all the SVGs and changing them to PNGs. It's working. 
as you can see it's coming 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 next up will be the gtk2 and we'll be running that for some time so i'm gonna pause again he has finished uh, all uh, changing all the assets so everything is red now which is great but as you can see there is a lot of errors here cannot write failed blah 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 so um that's normal and not panicking so we go to the user share themes this happens here i don't know why i don't care i know the solution to get rid of it so this text here delete it because it's a file and should be a directory and when it's a directory then it says oh it's a directory so we just run it again and then uh, everything is still not okay so we still have this little error and then you have to run it again <laughs> and done <laughs> there is a, the errors are gone and the system works I don't ask me why it's not my script but um, I, f I figured it out that um, second time around you run it that the errors are gone so we have now a working uh, testing we should test uh, this this icon set so we're gonna end the movie here and test it later on